Hey everybody, what's going on? Shabby Do here, and today we're gonna get back into that Shabby experience that is Coromon. So we left off with us about to get on this boat, but I also just realized when I came in, uh, I have a whistle available. So let's blow this bad boy, blow this Lux Lure, and let's see what the next Coromon is that we're gonna unlock here. As long as we capture him successfully, of course. Oh, it's the weasel. Oh good, level 11. Just use some normal attacks. Slam him. Alright. I might be able to just hit him with a good ember. Let's hit him with that cinder. 27 to 15 to 12. So I can hit him with another cinder. Cinder that bad boy. Ooh, 2 HP. Beautiful stuff. Why, why are you using coin snatch? You're not you're not a real person. All right, go to spinners. Plane spinner. Yeah, he's a normal type. Let's use that. We have a big normal type party here, I feel. All right, let's check him out. Not bad. Obviously standard potential. We got coin snatch, sand ball, 40 power, throw a blob of sand, 10% chance to lower accuracy. That's cool. Scratch is a cut type, also with 40 power, has a 20% increased critical hit chance. That's pretty nice. And tail spin, normal, at 25 power though. Oh, one to three times. So it's like tail swipe. Oh, that's awesome. As a it has a 25% increased chance of critical hit. That's some good stuff right there. Well, he'll become, he'll probably become a big heavy part of the team here. That, that's a good one. Having that critical boost, bam. All right, we got to talk to this guy. Yep, we're ready. Anchors away. I could always swim out to the boat, too. Oh, cool. I thought something crazy was going to happen while we were out there, like the SSAN. Now operate the Buzzlet Lab at the center of the island. Oh, and in case you want to ride back, just let me know. He'll be right here. Cool. Ah, chest. Cocoa fruit. Stir fruit. nothing hidden here so this is the mart there's something hidden there though silver spinner thank you very much oh good we got to teleport so now we can teleport to donor island gotta come in here we gotta heal our boys up I gotta check everyone's levels too i kind of forget so all right everyone's like 11 ish so like 12 is about the average 12 13 so let's get Slitherpin and Moful up here. We'll level these guys up. Excuse me, how are you? My Houndos finally has a trait I want after using the trait formator on the upper floor. It was slightly expensive. Oh, that's cool. Go check it out. Let me see. So if I wanted to change someone's things, like what is... No, not Beazel. What does um, Patterbit have, right? Summary... He is traders robber. The spoils go. The victor steals 50% extra gold when defeating a trainer. Eh, not bad. A trait form. What does it do? Let me ask you this. Have you ever captured a Koromon with a trait you don't like? There's some bad luck right there. Well, look no further because today what we've got for you is the slap chop. We're going to just slap the traits right on there. All right, that's useful. Does it guarantee a new trait? Don't worry, my transformator will 100% guarantee a new trait for your Cormon. I can't guarantee which trait it will be, however. We'll have to wait for the transformation to complete to find out the trait. Well, let's try it. 
250. I have six. Yeah, let's just try it. Let's see. I want to see how it looks. I will put powder bed in there. Do you want to change the rubber tray? Yep. Why not? Test it out. All right, I'll get to it. I'll send you a message on your phone when I'm done. Oh, it doesn't happen immediately. Very well. Your what? My potent flater. You look confused. Let me explain why I why I've designed the potent deflator. The potent deflator. Potent deflator. I don't know. When I was still a young trainer, I once got a Cormon with a po with a potent potential. It was almost perfect. So I thought, what if I could increase a Cormon's potential? That's why I dedicated my life to build the potent deflator. And I can say with pride, it works. Makes all Cormon perfect. Oh no, I'm afraid that's not possible. It can only slightly increase the potential. To be exact, the potent inflator will increase the Cormon's potential value by one. But if you're the if you're lucky, the potent inflator can increase the, the value by more than that. Just let me know if you want to give it a spin. Let's try it out. Why not, right? Let's see. Yeah, why not? Let's use the potent inflator and let's use it on uh Taruga. You sure? Can only do this once. Yeah, why not? Why the heck not? Try it out. Send my baby in there. Let's go, Taruga. I need to take your Cormon for a while. Watch your phone. Uh, again? I'm down too. That's all right. Mm, almost missed this chest. Meaning a Triscuit. Yeah, I found 500 gold. Got my money back. All right, that was cool. All right, everyone's healed up. You can do a little training. I don't have a whistle. I've already gone this way. What's in the market? I see you. I think Look, Solus is watching us. Since I arrived on the island, there are more items available to me in shops. Lovely weather, isn't it? Buy items. What do you got? Oh, he's got medium HP cakes. Very cool. Defense Cokes, Cokes, Cokes. I like how they're all Cokes. That's cool. Catch electric type? Yeah, let me buy one of those. Stinky scent. Um, I'll use the 50% coupon. Yep, that's okay. Why not? It was a pretty expensive. 500, 250 off. Pretty decent deal, I'd say. Shine bright, my friend. Let's go explore. Was just dumb. No, I'm penetrating tests on Powderbit for Luxolus. Wait, what? You're doing tests for Powderbit? Uh, increase the SP attack of Cormon when in danger. Dip fruit. The risk of getting a status ailment when using an electric attack. <coughs> Ooh, bless me. Let's use that one. I think I, I think when as I sneeze, I selected the one for while it's sleep. If something falls asleep, it'll immediately wake up. Who are you? I tried SP Cake M to get some more energy, but it kept me awake all night. My shift is starting soon. Never again. Well, thank you. Um, I'm going to do regain focus immediately when starting to feel hazy. Removes poison. We'll do poison. Just so I can get a variety of these things, you know? All right. That's it for here and over there. And there's nothing down here for me. So let's head up here. Always got to check for the secret stuff. Anything? Anything? Let's head inside. This looks main questy. This is moving. Floating globe. How does it even work? Like how he turned to look at me like I'm an idiot. In this level, we make battery packs for areas. I can't see, Kogoro. Get out of my way. I have no energy. I love spreading positive energy. Oh, that's nice of you. Even with all the craziness, we still abide by the rules. If you want to enter, you'll need a lab coat. 
<laughs> no, or just lab coat image. I love it. They're here. Oh, sorry. I thought you were one of those weirdos Thomas talked about on the phone. They could be anywhere at the dark, thunderous cave. We're not safe anymore. Tell me what's going on. Oh, you're right. Breathe in. Count to four. Ah, my dear partner and colleague, Thomas. He was being chased. To get away, he had to lock himself in the fuse room deep within the cave. I would go search for myself, but I'm not qual quite qualified for that. I'm lost. I don't know what to do anymore. Don't worry. I'm a battle researcher. I could go there for you. Really, that would mean the world to me, but the Thunderous Cave is a dark, dangerous place. Let me help you prepare. You'll need this helmet with an integrated light. Otherwise, you'll surely get lost in the dark. Don't call me Shirley, okay? Also, take some of these combi cake, S, and stinky scent. Stinky scent? That means less training. Yeah. The entrance to the cave is at the beach. You can't miss it. Good luck. What's this? What do you do? Beep, 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 boop, boop. So what's what's with all these guys in here? What's up, baby? Puzzlet? Oh, they're like powering shit in here. See? Do you know there are gases which can conduct electricity? You better be careful when you use your stink module in a thunderstorm. Well, that that makes me want to do it now. Now I'm gonna have to use my stink module on a thunderstorm and see what happens. Uh, I've already talked to these guys. Let's get out of here. They got nothing more for me. Gotta go find our buddy. There's always someone hiding up here. Hey, bub. It's a fascinating construct. Let's observe it. It was built to act as a lightning rod that can store the energy from the bolts that hit it. The energy is then transported to all of the Lua. The Titan living there bends the weather, guiding thunderstorms to the island. It's thanks to the Volt Guard that will never run out of energy. So we want him to stay there. So why am I fighting him? Is it a friendly battle? Zombie cake. I would like to use my, uh, what's it called? My Lux Lure here, please. I guess there's nothing here to actually do. So, oh, I must be able to, wait, this, that must have to move, right? Yeah. I oh, know, uh, F. Ah, you can't trick me. HP cake. And SP cake medium. Sweet. Can use those. I see you back here. Oh no, you're nothing. I guess that's the cave entrance that we need to get into. But there's different things over here too. I can't. I must not be able to go into this thing just yet, right? What's this? Phoenix shard, useless to me. I can't revive anybody, anyways. Seems to be locked by electro something. But I didn't see it. Very well. Very well. It seems loud. Did the, did my volume settings change again? Turn that down just a bit. Maybe it's just the thunder, but it seems loud. The deep blue. I've always dreamed of sailing beyond the horizon instead of working in the lab. Anchors away. Three sheets to the wind. <laughs> Maybe one day. Oh, Joe, I believe in you. Ooh, I saw you. Ooh, a trick spinner. Is that the one that uh, we get a little boost if we throw it first? A clear cake. I don't know what that's going to do, but fine. Usually we call clear cake cakes jello, but you know. What's this? You're glowing. Nothing I can do with it, though. Okay. Let's see what kind of levels are in here before we try and catch something, too. <gasps> what is, he's glowing. Is he perfect? He can't be perfect, right? Oh, there's one way to know, right? Do this. One of my spinners. Uh, let me see what the trick one was. Effective one, use it at the start of a battle. A dream spinner. Use it. Yep. Okay, so definitely wasn't. It might just be higher level because he's gl he's pretty glowy. He's level eight. Okay. So we'll use my poison sting. Ooh. Paralyzed? Oh, accuracy decreased badly. Badly, huh? Ooh, it went down by two. So I've got constrict. Let's use constrict out. Got wrapped and is prevented from leaving. It's using cute pose. That's a pretty perfect time to use cute pose is when you're inside me. 
So, wait. Trapping the target and lowering its speed for five turns. Okay, I thought it did like damage too, but I guess not. But the last one did six damage. This is going to go from 19 to, eight to 11. Okay. That was pretty good damage. I'll use it again then. Boom. Drain it. Radical. Goodbye, friend. All right, he leveled up. Well, he didn't level up. We just defeated the thing. <gasps> new message from Marin. We'll wait until we get another new message. How do I use my phone? Uh, phone. Use it. I found some more interesting books for you at the library. Um, yes, drop by when you can. Oh, he must have another quiz for us. I don't know if I'm ready for that just yet. HP cake, thank you. Ooh, a burr fruit. I want to see what's down here first before I go up top. Do, 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 do. I have a feeling we're going to see a lot of electric types in here. Drain it. 34. Ooh, that was pretty weak. Level 11. Ooh. And it depleted my energy a bit, too. Let's, um, I'm going to swap, actually. Squat up. Let's send out my Beezle. Send it. You're up, Beezle. Forget. Ah. I forgot my Beezle was pretty OP too. Okay, that's where that is. Nothing there for me. Oh, he's glowing too, so maybe that's just how they look. Wow. Tailspin. Swarm diversion. Oh, that's what that one thing was that lowered my accuracy. No, my evasion. Accuracy. Three hits. Not too shabby. Is Lumen? Oh, so Hut is good against electric? I remember that. I'll remember that. Let's see what you got for me, baby. He had a thing on, so I know he's a trainer. I just redeemed my gauntlet coupon. I can already feel this new bling making me stronger. Hmm. All right, Shane, if that's your real name. This could be rough. It's a 4v3 here, and if he's got some levels, I could be uh, hurting. Uh, it's not bad. So, Taruga. I'm going to try Tailspin first to see what we got for damage here. Four. And it only hit once. Okay. Let me see scratch all right we're gonna swap them out actually i don't really have anyone strong besides bezel huh <clears throat> try sandball oh that was okay critical jesus i was like damn that was some damage damn daniel all right Look at that. Leveled up. Almost got the potential up, too. The speed. It's definitely an attack, mostly. Yeah, it's got special, good special attack, too, though. 
Yeah, we're definitely swapping here, though. We're down to 17. Fiddly. Fiddly is a water type. So electric, foul skills, and ice skills. Let's send out my burb. Send out burb. Herb also has a snatch skill, so we could probably get some gold off this guy. 32 does 10 damage, huh? Oh. Oh, God. No more. Who stop? We gotta send out the big boys. That one hurt. That almost got me. I almost lost one for for good. Thirty-two. Okay. I'm at you with that double sting, baby. Stand ready to soak damage. Oh god. As long as it doesn't hit four times, we should be fine. My God. Use that HP cake. That fury pincer is deadly. Oh my God, it crit me. I got to use a medium one. It's kind of a waste, but we need to get them topped off so I can attack here. Need to be able to take two hits. Have to use another cake. If he hits me with that fury pincer and it hits three times, it's dead. Okay, you scratch. Pretty sure it's alternating, so. But I had to. I couldn't take the chance. Jesus. That was a rough one. Ooh, Mofal awakened some potential. Um, let me go with... Let's bring your special attack up and give you one more speed. Slitherpin also leveled up. Awesome job. Houndos. Oh, he is beautiful. I want him. I want him right now. Thank you for disappearing immediately. This battle was harder than it should have been. Goes to show we need to get our other boys leveled up too. Well, the pin is like all attack. Let's go. That was rough. I definitely don't want to do another trainer battle, but I'll do some of these still. This is still plenty fine. And with the sand ball. You posed me. Hit me with the cute pose again. I mean, do that all day. All day, please. That's fine with me. Can't go that way. Oh, good. Oh, no, no, no. Don't use that. The potentiflator of your Corbon is ready. Come by at the earliest convenience. Oleg here. Okay, I didn't get to look at the other message, but fine. So let's make a circle and let's head back to town. Luxury call. I don't think I can use that. What's this? Okay, nothing I can do. 
just looked like a hole to hide stuff in, you know? <gasps> Armando. Armando. I know there's no N in there, but I want him to just be called Armando. Sandoval. Alright, I'll survive as long as he doesn't crit me, so let's hit this. Thank you for playing. I crit him. Mofo return. All right, so let's um swap Bezel in, right? Can't go there, but there's stairs there. Combi cake M. Awesome. All right, we're going to get out of here. Go grab our other Cormon, heal up, and then we're going to come back in here and continue this blitz. And we're also going to catch our new guy. I'm going to probably leave someone at home because I don't want all these normies with me. I want actually, well, he'll be low, so I won't keep him with me. Yeah, that's not a great idea, huh? We'll, uh, we'll continue through with the normies and we'll level up this guy separately or whoever I catch, you know? Perfect. He fainted. 99 XP. Slipping gains 19. Let's go. All right, let's go get our boys back. All right, in we go. Wait, not here. I'm at the wrong place. We need to go to the Coromon Health Center. Thunderclouds fill the skies. Don't forget your umbrella. I feel like this is a place no one would ever forget their umbrella. It's always raining, so, you know. All right, let's heal and head upstairs and see what these things do. Fully restored, come back, thank you. Maybe my mustache will be coming up here. In we go. All right, what do you got? Had a bit as a new trait, conductor. Wish it would like show it to me. So let's come, actually we'll do two at once here. So come over here, you're back. Potential finder is complete. Your Taruga's increases potential. It went from 11 to 14. Oh, I think 25 is the highest, right? But that's not bad. I gained three points out of that. So we'll take that. Put him up at the front there. I'm going to put my Moful there as well. But I'm going to put, I'm going to put Moful here. I'm a bunch of these milestones. Oh, I got no more. Okay. All right, we got everyone. Oh yeah, so let's check out Hatterbit here. Summary. Charges when hip increasing its speed. Okay, well, that's actually really perfect timing for this dungeon, huh? Hmm, it almost feels like it was uh, planned that way. All right, let's explore this dungeon a bit more, level up our guys, and let's go actually catch Hopefully, what's our first electric Coromon? Let me look at the map here. So, so here, Thunderous Cave. <gasps> they have that Lunar Dog and this one too and something else. Oh my God. I hope we get one of them. Woodlow Harbor, the electric, the fire. I don't know what the gold bar means. Sand? Okay, okay, come on. Here, here's hoping for something amazing. Watch, we're gonna get another moleful or something. I'd be so mad. Be so mad. Actually, you know what I haven't done in a while? Uh, save. All right, let's do this. All right, in we go. Let's get our first quorum on here and then we'll maybe explore the next floor. And then that'll probably be good. But yeah, guys, if you're still loving Coromon, as usual, hit that like button down below and do hit subscribe if you are new here as well. So you get back here for that sweet, shabby content. All right. Um, it's level 11, so it can definitely survive a sandball. Not very effective. Didn't do a lot of damage, but I'm afraid if I hit with this, it's going to kill it. So let's back it up and let's just use an item here. We've got our uh, static spinner. Definitely an electric type. Atta boy. Uh, yeah, let's check them out. So, good HP, low attack, good, or not even good special attack. It's got more defense than anything, so it's more of a defensive boy. 
Uh, da, 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 database number 70. Quad bolt. Yep. Not holding anything. The Cormon charges when hit with an electrical attack. Yeah. All right. Uh, send to Cormon storage. He's, he's useless to us right now. He's already low HP. He's an electric type in an electric dungeon. Like, what? what is that going to do for us? But what I do want to do is, um, I remember we got some sort of item uh, right here. This thinky disc. I'm going to give that to my boy Moful over here so we can... So we can have a chance to repel wild Pokemon. So because, you know, this is just like the freaking caves with zoo bats everywhere. These things are all over the place here. Ooh. So let's drop one of these sandballs on. The sandball is great against these electric types. Very effective. Very nice. Uh, yep, you're all toughened up. Yep, that's nice, pretty boy. Take a sandball, chill out, relax, okay? Okay. Glad we all got on the same page with that. Bowful leveled up. Awesome. Potential's not quite there, like maybe a quarter of the way, so that'll take him a bit. This is a good little spot to level up a Moful, though. So if you got a Moful and you want to level him up... So I want to go... I want to go check out the area that was over here, where that person was sitting, with that ladder there. I want to go check that out. One shot, one kill. See you later, buddy. 116 XP. See, we could we could level this bad boy up in here all day. All day. All right, let's keep it rolling. I feel like there should be stuff in these pillars. Aha! 350 gold. Who just leaves that behind? <gasps> I didn't see that before. Chest. Cool, cool. All right, before I fight this guy, let's hit this little save here. Saved. And I'm going to keep Moful here. Mm. I'm going to bring in Beezel, actually. Because I don't... No, let's keep... No. Yeah, we'll keep Moful, at least for one. Yeah, let's do it. Moful's in. I heard rumors there's a rare Coromon up ahead. I should prepare. Oh, I hope... I hope we can capture something on every floor of this pace. Ooh, if not, that would really hurt if there's a rare Pokemon in the next area and not here. All right, so we got Armando. Let's hit him with a little sandball. We'll probably deal half his health. Or it'll be a crit and almost kill him. Okay. Beautiful. I love to see it. Now let's hit him with the scratch olies. That'll just finish him off for nice and cheap SP. Painted. All right. Constrict. Eh, I don't care about that. It doesn't do damage, so. What do you got? Oh, the pinchy boy. We got to switch. Uh, this guy takes extra damage from that cut attack. He's weak to cut. Wait, does that mean you're weak to cut? Uh, shoot. Let's use Patterbit. Send out Patterbit. My boy, Patterbit, you're in. Fiddly uses Toughen Up. Well, you know what we're going to do? We're going to feel you out. We're going to do learn all about your feelings. <laughs> Found a weak spot. Yeah, this attack would really hurt my other... Oh, good. It doesn't deal, like, any damage to Patterbit. Patterbit is just a boss. Just an absolute animal. And let's hit him with a propeller punch. One shot. Come on. Do it to him. Do it to him. Oh, he barely survived. He was knocked down, though. Just slam into him. Pink. Goodbye. So long. Farewell. A little bit of XP for everybody. Everyone enjoy. We'll just, uh... Oh, Houndos. Oh, I wanted... I wish I found you. I wish I found you in here. That would have been amazing. Uh, we'll do another feeler attack. Let's try and one-shot this guy. Ooh, he licked me with that electric static tongue. Speed decrease, okay. 
All right, he was already going ahead of me anyway, so. I mean, I'm a bug with like a propeller on me. I, I'm not that fast. Like a hot air balloon strolling around the place. Ooh, baby, we got him. Just one shot that boy. I wonder what level powder bit levels up or evolves at. I feel like he's one of those like two stage evolution kind of guys where he's like, you know, like mid thirties kind of thing. Cause he's just so strong. It's a stonk, stonky boy. Remember, how am I supposed to catch rare Pokemon with such a weak squad? Ah, uh, 376 for winning. I probably should have used my bird and stole from him a bit, but that's okay. What do you got to say? Some battle researchers have spent hours upon hours to find a lunar pup. <gasps> that's the, that's the dog we saw. That's so silly. They, don't they know it? It can only be found down that ladder. <gasps> we got to get him. We have to get him. Okay. 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 Everyone act cool. Act cool. Act cool. All right. We're going down this ladder. And we're going to look for him. Okay. We can. Woo. We can still do this. Let's go. Use the Lux Lure. Come on, Lunar Pup. Give, me, give it to me. Give it to me. <gasps> He's right there. It's Lunar Pup. Boop, boop. Twilight set in? I don't know what that means, but... Uh, Non-Ghost Corp won't have a 10% chance to miss. So he's a ghost type. Um, Magic and ghost skills. Half from normal and cut, which is all I have. So let's hit him with a scratch then. Hypno wave. Am I going to be put to sleep? Yep. Okay. Dead asleep. Cool. Cool. I'm going to keep him out because I feel like I might just mighty roar. Lower attack. Mofo's attack decreased and I woke up. I got lost in the twilight. Oh boy. Fight of the century here. Alright, that was pretty weak. It did four damage. Let's see if we can do tail spins and get a little bit more out of that. Hack is just falling like crazy, though. It just missed entirely, because why not? Fine, Sandball. We'll hit him with a real attack. I know my Scratch will do four as long as it doesn't crit, but it does have an increased chance to crit. <gasps> oh my god. I thought he was gonna die. That was crazy. Ah, yes. Special attack is 24. Ghost type. Common rarity. So it's not even rare, but I'm happy still. I want him. I wanted a doggo. The fate attack. 50 power, a little less accuracy. It's a foul attack and it's physical. Sneak up, dealing damage. This attack always goes first. Hypno wave and mighty roar. Cool. Dark atmosphere. Starts twilight upon entering a battle, which is great because it gives standard and normal types. Uh, send to the storage, though. It's not going to do me any good in my party right now. But man, all right, cool. We got him. That's I wanted him so bad when I saw him that first time when we found him in that trainer battle. And we've got them. But all right, before we further explore this, I think that's going to do it for here, guys. So as usual, like I said, if you're new here, hit that subscribe button as well. And if you want to see this series, keep going. Hit like and leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. But as usual, this has been Shabby Doo. And I hope the rest of your day is not too shabby.